Okay everyone, I've got a Keurig here that uh, we haven't been using for a while. Just put some water in it, into the reservoir, and uh, I got this uh, uh, the sound where uh, you, you know it's not pumping the water into the reservoir you know, or into the boiler of the, uh, of the machine. So uh, I'm going to show you a quick fix here for how to uh, get this up and running again. Uh, it involves uh, a turkey baster, of all things. Okay, so what tends to happen is uh, this thing's been sitting around for a while, so you got some uh, build up, some water scaling, and uh, it just makes a thin crust. Some are in the mechanism. So you could take this guy off, you could wash it out. You know, uh, don't recommend using soap or anything like that, but <clears throat> if it's been up for a while, you might want to do that. <clears throat> the next thing you want to do is, you know, put a little bit of water into the reservoir here, go down and suck up some of this. It's water here, and then just where uh, inside the reservoir, down below where is, the water spout is uh, at the bottom of the reservoir there, you want to put the turkey baster over the top and just give it a couple of quick jolts, a few pumps in there, and what you might find is you might see some scales move around. It could be the scales that are coming up from inside the dirty reservoir. But essentially what it's doing is just pushing some water, forcing water up inside the unit and uh, breaking through any of that scaling that might be going on. So this water was clean when I put it in there, but I'm already noticing that you probably see that there, some scaling going on. So yucky stuff. Anyhow, uh, if you do that a few times, give it a few forceful bursts of water from your turkey baster. Now if you have a syringe or something else for basting your turkey, that might work as well, but that's what I had. You turn it on, and uh, the thing should work. Just put your, your cup in there. Grab one of those. Put the cup in. Hit the brew. And that's the sound you want. You want to start seeing the water disappear in the reservoir. In my case it is. And there we go. Back up and running. We haven't used this thing for months. So uh, looking forward to some fresh coffee this morning. Enjoy.